All right, YouTube, it's March 18th. We're at the Big St. Charles Gun Show. There's over 500 tables. We're going to go check out what prices they are. Oh, here's the, here we go, here we go. Let's go down here. This is what she was looking at, Gavin. I brought my, my nephew's like, I want to buy one, and I said, I want to buy one. All right. What do we got today? We got the 5.56, five, you got the 300 blackout pistol. We have the, another 5.56 five, and the 7.6239. Looks like they're running low, Gavin. All right, guys, we've got the Great Lakes. It's a GL10, 308, 1,000 bucks. Got another Great Lakes and 223 Wild, 700. Another Great Lakes pistol, 223 Wild, 700. Got a Delton, 556, $700. Delton ARs, 470 bucks. And 556. Ooh, Keltec KS7. Just picked that up last episode. Uh, GSG Firefly 22, 300. Got a few of these, 300. 300, yeah. It's got a little fake can on it, Gavin. Yeah. I bet that's your favorite one. Oh, for sure. GSG in 1911, it's a 22 long rifle, I bet. Yep, 400. GSG, 400. More for 400. The UTAS Uzi, nine millimeter, 600. Glock 45, 650. Glock 45, 500. Glock 45, 500. Glock 36 and 45, five, 600. Got a Glock 20 Gen 4, 10 millimeter, 650. Glock 20 SF, 1050. Sorry, Glock 20 SF, 10 millimeter, 650. Another 10 millimeter, 500. So this is actually a really good price on a 10 mil, but it's a factory rebuild. It's 500 bucks. They got a 5.7 right here. Ooh, 5.7, 700 bucks. Close out. Excuse me. Close out. Smith and Wesson. Night sights. Three mags plus a hundred dollar mail-in rebate. That is not bad. So you're running six hundred on that with a mail-in rebate. MMP 2.0. Three mags. And the 40. 600. 600. Nine mil. LE optic ready. 600. Again. 600. Six. Running six on all of these. But a hundred dollar mail-in rebate. Three mags. Night sights. What we got here, Gavin? We got the CSX, Smith & Wesson, I believe. Yeah. $600, $700 rebate, or $75 rebate. Some more Smiths, SD9s, got 440 on those. Running the equalizer. Oh, it's 45. So 45, it's got all the, all the options. Uh, 500 MMP shield, nine mil. 30 super carry, 500, 9 mil, 440. And that's Smith on a 9 millimeter, 600. Smith easy, 9 millimeter, 400. We got 500 on this 9 mil here. We're running 10 millimeter Smith & Wesson, MMP 2.0, 700. Another one for seven. 40 Smith & Wesson for six, 9 mil, six. We've got the CZ, 9mm, 350, that's not bad. CZ, 500, another CZ, 9mm, 500, another CZ, 9mm, 500, 500, CZ, 9mm. That's a Springfield, 1911, 9mm, I like 9mm. This is the Browning High Power Copy that they have. Browning High Power Copy, Springfield Armory, SA35, 9mm, 800 bucks. Very nice. Got it. Nice. XDM Elite, 9mm, 650. Gavin's carry. Shadow Systems, 700. 9mm, 700. I haven't seen these. Shadow Systems. You ever heard of Shadow Systems? Uh uh. I mean, there we are. You're 5'7, 700. Got the 9mm, 400. Comes with the uh, red dot on it. Optic, optic already included. Right. What we got here? Taurus, 9mm, 300. 99, G3C 9 mil. What is this? TX22 with the splatter. What's it feel like in your hands in the splatter paint? Feels kind of cool. Uh, here yeah, I'm rugged. Rugged. All right, a couple more. 350, $400 for these Taurus TX22s. Got a Bursa 350, 9 mil. Diamondback. Man, that's a nice little carry. Look at this little thing. 
Feels good in the hand. This. Ooh, we've got a Rock Island 10 milli, 700. Another Diamondback 9 mil, 300. 300 on this Diamondback. This one, I wonder if they all come with that extended mag too. But I like this smaller one actually. I've been looking for a smaller concealed carry. All right, we got a Charter Arms 357, 500. We got the Charter Arms 38 Special, 500. What's this? Target Pathfinder 22 Long Rifle. My Charter Arms. Pink Lady, 500 bucks. All right, ooh, very pretty gun. Rock Island 38 Super. Very nice. Ooh, well, actually, I got some Rossies too. We got a Rossi. 750 for the 357 mag, 750 for the 45 long Colt Rossi. Got a 410, 500 bucks over under. Ooh, got the Keltec KSG. Just picked one up there earlier this month. 500 bucks on that tag. Keltec, the 22 Magnum, 650. Got the Keltec and 40 Smith and Wesson. Uses Glock 22 mags. Yeah, it's a foldover gun. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. So you clap that here, you just boo, shut it. Magazine goes in there just like a pistol, and uh, you've got yourself a really, really small gun when That's you're moving it around. Audio high point. That's way too expensive. Another high point. Ten millimeter high point. I had no idea high point made a ten millimeter gun. Me either. What the? F you got a nice pad. It feels like for a high point. It's got to. It's got to have something nice about it. <laughs> That's crazy. 10 millimeters is too expensive or I would uh, buy that just to have it and be like, I got a 10 millimeter high point. That's, do we need to buy the 10 millimeter high point? I've never even heard of that. Ruger Precision, 17 HMR, 500. Got a Riley Defense AK, 5.45 by 39, 1200 bucks. Another one for 1200 with the folding stock. An IWI Gal Gal Galil Ace. Oh, a Galil. Nice, nice. More AK, Century Arms, 800 bucks a pop, 900 on this one with the furniture, 900 with the furniture, 800 on these AKs. Got 800 across the board, they're all Century Arms. Let's get to the PAPs. What we got on these PAPs? Let's see a tag on it. Here we go, 900 for the Draco. Man, I picked my Draco for 450. Really? Yeah, I can. I just can't buy a Draco at these prices. They're not, they're not functional guns. They're really not. I had a 75 round drum mag on mine. It was ridiculous. <laughs> Very nice. All right, let's move. All right, what we got here? Hometown Trinity Heroes. Got some plate, optics. What you looking at, Gavin? Looking at a couple other ARs. Uh, 650 and these DPMS is 695. We've got a 3030, 735, a Winchester Model 20, 22 long rifle, 400. Try to pump it, hold it. Yeah. Pumping. Got a Browning Bar, very nice guns, very nice guns. 1300 on that one. Another Browning Silver Hunter, 20 gauge, 3 inch. Very beautiful firearm. That's a Ruger 1022, 350. I really need to get picked me up one of them. Ruger AR-10, three magazines, sights included, unfired original in box, 1125. All right, M-Locks, been looking at these, 260. If I can get them to do 260 all in, I would absolutely do it. This is, I got a, all right, so gun showers last year, I lost the footage, but I picked up a, uh, a tire LPK with a, any other or any or other lower for an AR. And so I've been waiting for the right price on an upper so I can slap it on there. I've been walk, looking at these M locks so they don't come with a, they, the same type of charging handle on an AR, actually side charger. So instead of that back pull, they're side charger ARs. Got nice fake cans on these. You guys see the prices down here on these lowers. 320, and then 320. There's a 350 Legend, just 360 for that upper. All right, we'll come back. I might come up and ask about them because I got to buy that powder today so we can shoot that cannon. Yeah, so something I'm looking for today is uh, some powder 
so we can actually fire that cannon and get that on film. And then uh, I think the goal is to mount it to the side-by-side. -side. Gavin's customizing with what kind of motor? Jixer 600. Jixer 600 and a side by side. Next time we're out the farm, we're gonna have to fuck. We're gonna have to. Sorry. Next time we're out the farm, we're gonna have to kind of show the people what you got out there. Oh yeah. We've got the radical arms. You got 650 on that one. You got a JTS 219 on a pump 12. Not bad. Tactical looking guy right there. Some lowers. Complete lowers. How much on that complete lower? 225. That is. Oh. Not bad at all. For, that's a complete lower for 225. Yeah. I got 250 in the parts right now on mine at home. Yes. Prime, Prime Protection STS Tactical Boutique. All right, thank you very much. 1600. Don't mess with that finish. Beautiful firearm. 1600. Look at this one. We got the golden gun here. But there's something on it. We got to get that off of there. We got to take that off that table, too. Beautiful, 1600, oh, nice finish. Fantastic, I like this, look at this all black. Look at this all black. I like that color. 6.5 Creedmoor, that's pretty, 1400. Stars and stripes in black and white. Look at this finish on this one. Very nice, 30 odd six, 1500. I like pretty guns, got Steyr, 270 wind. Mag, 1750. TLC, TC, and 257 Weatherby Mag, plus ammo, plus ammo, 1700, very nice. Vulture Arms, 12 gauge, three chokes, 650, two stocks, oh, very nice. Usually don't see them come with multiple stocks, yeah. comes with that hard case, very nice. That's Benelli clone, Benelli. all the uh, Benelli parts will fit on that, all those will fit on Benelli. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like clones. I like affordability and reliability. And it comes with a five year warranty. And a five year warranty. So if anything happens yeah. in five years, you get all of those dudes in Michigan and they take care of you. Oh, yeah, made in Michigan? Yep. Very nice. We're actually filming a TV series uh, tomorrow. What's, what's it called so I can get it and I'll go give you a subscribe? It's uh, Bushy Tail Down. Bushy Tail Down. I'm the gun show show. Let's throw each other some love. How about that? Thank you. Awesome. I'm going to get a swoop of the table here. Yeah, go to bushytaildown.com and you'll get a right there there's a link to the youtube and the yep. uh facebook page. excellent i will support thank Thanks, you i appreciate, man, appreciate it. it got a table with some ancient history here seven millimeter mauser i don't want to touch this guy's guns i don't want to get my grease on them it's hard to see the price is 750 on this guy right here 223 pistol all done up 575, very, very nice finish. 575, that's not a bad price, especially given the Cerakote job done on these. 525, 575 on that blue one, very nice price. CPX, CPX? I've never heard of CPX. So if you ever uh, want to make your pistol in uh, SBR legally, you snack one of these up, they make them custom for your style, your actual gun, and then your pistol slides in yeah. here. And it doesn't make it any more accurate, but it makes it more controllable. Oh yeah, like imagine throwing your pistol in there and all of a sudden you've got this gun. Well, that's a spike to stab a man with. Locking cans, 80 bucks each, 40 millimeters. Ooh, we've got some helmets if we needed some targets. Got 780 on this AR pistol, 850. Very pretty guns. 850 on this silver one, 455 on this green upper, 7.62. Very nice. 950 for the rig right here. Very pretty gun. Got 900, 223 Wildy. Got the old Canic, 525. Another Canic. Puma three inch, five chokes, 350. Very pretty gun. See anything you like, Gavin? JRs, PSA, 850, PSA, 850. 450 Bushmaster and eight, 825 right there. Oh, Taurus Raging Bull, 44 mag, 650 baby. 
I've been wanting a 44 mag, man. Wheel gun. 1100 for that Draco. 750 on that AR pistol and 762 by 39. Okay. Uh, the Silver Eagle 12, 450, or 495, sorry. Winchester 264 mag for 1500. Got a Remington 22 250 cal with the scope, 1300. Got this Steyr 308, 1400 with the scope 18. We got a Savage A Series 22 cal, 525. Uh, all your prepping needs here. Got PSA upper, 450. Got a 308 upper, I don't have a lower for that. Got a 45 ACP Flint River Armory, $1,300 with a Sten mag. I've never seen that before, that is a pretty neat gun. Got us the that AR pistol. Cool. <laughs> we got that magazine. We got it at the house. That's a 300 blackout though. That's like, that's $100 plus a mag, yeah. no thanks. 600 on the Radical Arms, new inbox. I wanna see what these lowers are running. Rifle lower. Oh, we got price on these rifle lowers. You got any prices you can see on these? Running anywhere, we got a tag. I don't see anything, nope. All right, who knows on those lowers? Let's run this way. 300 blackout, 650. Got an upper and lower here. Got the 7639 AK for 600. I'd pick up an AK for 500 for sure, but I ain't trying to pay 600 for an AK. Well, we got 750 on this one. Got another thousand dollars on the one in the wood. Springfield Armory DEF new M box 650 got 650 on the Springfield Hellcat the Springfield Hellcat Pro 650 Springfield 9 mil 600 got a Springfield Armory 9 mil 1500 ooh very pretty very pretty another Springfield Armory 45 a Garrison Springfield 45 920. That's another 45. Ruger, thousand dollars. Garrison 920. Garrison Springfield 45 920. Very nice. The CP SCCY 275. MP 500. The old Ruger LCP 500. Our SCCY 275. And we've got the Ruger SP 101, eight, 900 bucks. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's not like a bad price at all. 230 for that lower, dude. Like, look at this, 230. I got 250 in my other one. That is a beautiful finish on that Ruger. 350, Ruger 1022. Look at that. That is beautiful. You got 500 on that 22, 250. 22 inch, 525, Ruger American, 556, 10 round bolt. Uh, it's got 390 on that Ruger 1022. And we got 355 on this Savage. And this is in 22 mag on this Savage right here. Another 350 Legend, 480, comes with the scope. It's not bad. I've been looking for a scoped out gun, but I want it in a caliber I already have. I don't want to, I need a 308. Actually, if I were to buy anything besides an AR today, it's a 308. 350 leverage and 490. There you go, entry level. There you go. It's not a bad price. A little Rossi Rio in 22 lever. 385 for this hybrid 20 gauge. Pretty gun. Waterfowl. 350. We're fantastic. How about you? Uh, Typhoon Defense 12 gauge, semi auto, 500. Got another one, Typhoon and FDE. Got it in gray, 500. The Mossberg 510 Mini. Got 430 on that one. Very nice. I got to walk away from 12 gauges. That's all I bought this year. Uh oh, check out this. Look at this 12 gauge pump for 150. Oh yeah. And a 12 gauge pump, that ain't bad price for a 12 gauge pump ever. 
GLFA AR10, thousand bucks. Very good prices on these. Diamondback, 308 win. Another thousand dollars. They got 500 on this ATI, 15 inch, 556. I like that. It's a nice finish on that. I don't know if you can see it in the camera. That real dark finish on that hand, hand guard. Get some single shots, a little single shot 410, 280. Got a Stevens 410, single shot 220. 230 on this single shot 410. Got 22, 250, 500 bucks, Savage Axis. Marlin 22 long rifle. Got a Browning A bolt. 830 on it. Got a Savage. I don't see the price tag on that. What we got here? Got a Keystone Arms Cricket 22 in American flag. 250. Got us another Keltec. 600 on this one. We're on the Arrow Precision. 500 on this lower. And a Takaron. 12 gauge. Is that a? Oh no, it's sighted jack bull pup. No, absolutely not. You know that, sir. How are you doing, Colonel? Used Beretta 625 for the storm. Uh, oh, five shot Ivar Johnson. I had somebody tell me they wanted me to buy one of those. Cap and ball. Not one. Not a bad price. 140. I usually see them a lot more uh, here at the uh, gun shows. Here for these Heritage Arms. 175. High points. High points. More back to a realistic price. <laughs> they make a 10 millimeter now. Yep. I might buy one yep. just to say I have a high point 10 millimeter. Diamondback in 22 and mag, all right, 300 bucks. That's a little Taurus, 300, got 290 on this one. We got the Taurus 627 tracker, 520, River 380, very nice. Ooh, we got a nice Lavender 370 for that Charter Arms. Got a Ruger Mark IV, 660. 470 on this Smith & Wesson M&P Shield. Very pretty gun right here. What is this? M&P PC Shield EZ 380 APC High Vis Light Wave H3 Sights. That's a pretty gun, but I'm not into uh, 380 Auto myself. Very nice. 1050 on that 44 mag. Got 920 on this 357 mag. Let's see. Got a Gearson MC19 at 45 APC. TSAS 430, 45 APC. Got a RIA 450 in 1911. Got the old SAR for 400, that's a, that's a good price. Gearson high power 15 round mag, 675 with the optic on it. Mechanic SFT 9 mil optic ready green bomber. That's a very pretty looking gun. Not sure if you can see that finish with the camera. Get that so I can get that up close so you can see that. Get my hat out the way. The pinup girl, look at that finish. I really like Canics too. Yes. They're probably one of the, the most surprising triggers I've ever had in an affordable firearm. The best trigger I've ever had in an affordable firearm is the Canic. We're about at our first battery change here at the St. Charles Gun Show. It is a little packed in here, getting a little warm. Got the jacket on, but it was snowing when we pulled up, right? Yeah. You see anything that interests you? I know you came looking for a specific. A couple ARs are interesting to me, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna make that call today. Make the call or not yet? Ooh. What we got here. Sig Sauer MPX 9 mil 2059, 20, 20, 2060. Got 1790 on this H and K 223. Very beautiful gun. kind of finish we got on this black rain fallout 15 very nice look at that handguard i like it i like it got a nice finish here on this one we got, we got springfield m1a and 308 very nice smith and wesson bullpup 12 gauge 960 The 500, yep, Shockwave, 440, that's a good price on a Shockwave. 390 on the Henry Golden, 22 short. Got the Wolf, 
wolf pelt color on this guy, the Ruger 1022. Just seen another one of these. Very nice. You got 300 on this Mossberg 835. Got 250 on that black aces, 12 gauge, 250. That's good. That's a pretty gun right there. Got 1900 here on the Springfield Hellion, 5.56. Sig Pop, oh, Sig, 9 mil, 11.90. Another Sig, P36, 9 mil, 600. Table full of Sigs, got 6.30 on this one. Another 6.30 for the 6 hour 365X. 4.80, 9 milli, 4.30, P3, P322. That's a 22 long rifle. A 22, 490. 537 on this FNH 22. 263 on this Taurus 9 mil. Ruger 22, 207. Another Ruger 22, 207. A few of them up here at that price. I'm gonna go and uh, look at a lot of tables. I'm positive I haven't seen everything. This show is quite large. There are a lot of people here. Um, but the most unique gun, I came actually to buy an AR under 500. Might still do that. So right now I'm debating between a high point and 10 millimeter just because, or pick up that AR for under 500 while it's still available. What do we got over here? Blackout. The let's, the let's go Brandon sale right here, 500 for this AR rifle. Are we buying an AR in 76239? That means we got to buy some ammo. We're buying an AR in 556, we got to buy some ammo. We're buying a high point in 10 mil, we got to buy some ammo. So, what are you, what are you thinking? What do, you, what do you think is the best episode? Do we pick one of these? Well, we talked to the vendors and they said these $500 ARs might be coming to an end. Because um, they can't get them anymore. There's a few on that table. Let me know. What do you think? I think that high point 10 millimeter. High point 10 millimeter. I've never owned a. All right, let's go talk. Let's go talk pricing. Take 400. All in, or 420 all in. 420 all in. I'll eat the tax. All right. I like it. I like it. Hey, outdoor working with me again, guys. Awesome. Awesome. We're gonna pick up a high point 10 millimeter. I don't know why, other than to have one. Well, I will run back here in a few minutes. All right. Do you guys sell ammo? Do you guys have no, ammo? We're just not oh, I could use two boxes of 10 millimeter, please. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Now I can shoot it affordably. Mr. Pete. How you doing? I got a cannon, and I was told that this is probably the powder I want to buy from you. Well, 20 bucks. All right. Well, this is eight ounces, it's not 16. Okay. I appreciate it. You're All righty. Thank you, Pete. Goodbye. All right, guys, we got some black powder for the cannon. Oh, I bought a high point 10 millimeter. Oh, did you? I don't know why. Those two things don't belong in the same sentence. No, they don't. Gun show show came out to the big St. Charles gun show today. We picked up the high point 10 millimeter. We literally walked by it, stopped, did the double take. <laughs> what the hell is this? And uh, yeah, er, skirt. And uh, actually found some ammo for a pretty good price, man. I've been, I've looked at 10 mil before and I found it for much more expensive and we were able to pick up hundred rounds for 60 bucks. I thought that was pretty affordable uh, given the price and more rarity of the 10 millimeter uh, cartridge. And then we picked up uh, some smokeless powder for the cannon. So we've got a couple episodes now we can film between the Keltec, which we've got to get up, the cannon we've got to get up. I've got to upload this episode and then we've got to put up this new high point 10 mil. Hold on, is it threaded? It's, yeah. Unthreaded. Uh, threaded. Hold up. Did we just buy a threaded high point 10 it's millimeter? Cool. It's got a threaded barrel? <laughs> what is high point doing? Make sure you like, subscribe, hit that bell, and check out the follow-up video of us shooting this thing.